Listening to Focus 94.3 FM. My name is Jeff Abwaje. So, the song that you just listened to, as you can note, is coming from the NDC. We are here this evening to declare the results of the KNUST chapter. Yes. I have with me here some great gentlemen in the studios to help me with their declaration. Right, so the, here are some portfolios that we are going to uh, listen to their results. Yes. We have the president and the vice president, the woman commissioner and the deputy woman women commissioner. We have the general secretary and the deputy general secretary. We also have the financial secretary and the deputy financial secretary. The organizer and the deputy organizer. And then the PRO and the deputy PRO. Yes. I have in the studios the electoral commission chairman, that is Mr. or Master Marvin Ousuansa. And his deputy here in the studios, yes. Edwin AJ. And this evening they're going to help us with the election declaration of 10. Good evening, gentlemen. 
Good evening, Good Mr. Evening. Jeff. What are you doing? We are oh, doing very well. God yourself. Christ. I'm doing very well. How how was the election today? Well, today it was smooth. Just that we encountered certain problems when we began earlier, because it was a new system and there was some hitches here and there. So it was very hectic earlier on. But as it proceeded, we were able to sail through smoothly, and we are, we have been able to have an incident-free election. Well, that's interesting. Yes. But if you compare it to, I mean, previous elections, <laughs> I think this is the best the ever best election ever. in Kenya University. Best the best ever. Ever, best ever. yes. Is it the because Kenya you are the electoral no, commission? That's why. On record. <laughs> on record. Yeah, on record so far. For twenty-six, 26 years. years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The yeah, best yeah. record ever. Yes. All right, that's so interesting. All right, so what do you have for us? So what we have for you to tonight is the results from the election. 10 Kenya University election this year and before I even proceed I would like to start from the uncont uncontested portfolios before resuming into the contested ones okay so in no order in particular I will start from the deputy Ukom position which was uncontested and it was contested by Selma Yoda the only contestant for the election and she had 180 votes of yes and 11 votes of no okay so the the yes represented 94.24 percent and the no also represented 5.7 percent so to hold on to that i would like to give some breakdown for today's election before i even proceed to the mention of the results the total registered voters for this year election for Ten Kenya University were 1,087 people, uh, 1,087 members, and the total vote cast for this year election was 585. So the voter turnout was 53.8 percent, and out of that 585 number, the total number of 199 females casted their votes. That makes the female percentage of the voter turnout to be 17.57%. So to proceed. And the male? We, we didn't compute for the male because the male had no special features. So it was only the females that no. voted for the no. women commissioner. No, so okay. the male, they voted for all the other oh, portfolio by the women commissioner and the deputy women commissioner. Okay. Yes. So when you subtract the 191 from 585, you get that component for the males. Yes. So to proceed, Chris Santu Sangna, who contested for the deputy PRO portfolio, also had 546 votes for yes and 38 votes for no. So the yes represented 93.3% and the no's represented 6.5%. Imano Kobina Ephraim, who, uh, who was the only aspirant for the Deputy Financial Secretary portfolio, also had 543 votes for yes, 42 votes for no. So the yes represented um, the yes represented 92.8% and the no's represented 7.18%. So the Deputy General Secretary portfolio uh, was also con contested by two people and in Edmund Amano Matania Pete had total vote of 281 representing 48.03 percent and Peter Aringura Arene had a total vote of 304 votes representing 51.9 percent so that will be all for the deputy deputy uh, category okay. so we are now moving into the main heads okay. so with the main heads we, we also had one uh, one portfolio being oh. contested by just one candidate yes we had two actually we had two so our Sadat's Ahmed also contested for the financial secretary 
who had 536 of yes, representing 91.6 percent, and 49 representing 8.4 percent. Frida Ohinado also contested for the PRO position. She was the only candidate for that portfolio, and she had a total vote of yes of 552 representing 94.4 percent and a no of 33 representing 5.6 percent which one another who was also the only candidate for the organizer portfolio also had a yes of 558 representing 95.4 percent and a no of 42 representing 7.2 percent so these are the uncontested i mean with respect to the number of people meaning only one person contested okay. for the main portfolios now moving into the contested ones so um before we move on to that can you run us through those who contested and then i mean those who won in the uncontested category okay so for the main and then the deputies so the deputies yeah. so with the power vested in me as staying king westy electoral commission the portfolio of deputy pro is krista chris santos sangna he won with 93.3 percent yes for deputy financial secretary emmanuel kobina ifrim also won with five five hundred and forty three votes of yes, which represents ninety two point eight percent. Selma Yoda, who contested for deputy women's commissioner, is also the deputy women's commissioner elect with a total yes of one hundred and eighty, representing ninety four point two percent. Okay, and. Um, I believe that will be all for the deputies okay. the uncontested deputies so the contested deputies the general secretary portfolio which was contested between peter aringura Aweni and edmond amano matania pity which was won by peter aringura Aweni with a total vote of 304 representing 51.9 percent so yes so I think we are done with the deputies. All right. Both the contested and the winners. So now we move on into the main portfolios. And the uncontested ones was the main PRO, which Frida Ohine Ado won with a total vote of 552, representing 94.4%. So Frida Ohine Ado is the PRO elect for 10 KNUST. Anwar Sadat Ahmed, who was also the only gentleman to contest for the financial secretary portfolio, also won with a yes of 536, representing 91.6%. Anwar Sadat Ahmed is the financial secretary elect for 10 KNUST. Which one Anabewa, who was also the only gentleman to contest for the organizer portfolio, also won with 558 yes representing 95.4 percent so which one another one is the thinking was the organizer elect so now we have to walk you through the um the gentlemen and my dear ladies who contested for the various position before i move on to the results i think because of our time you have to move straight forward to the results, to the results. okay they are all waiting for the results okay exactly so for the general secretary portfolio which was contested between Emmanuel Bawa and Joseph Kalon Lobile Lobile sorry Emmanuel Bawa had a total vote of 389 representing 66.5% and Joseph Kalon also had 196 votes representing 33.5% so Emmanuel Bawa is a 10 general secretary elect for the vice president's position, which was contested between a lady and a gentleman named Fuad Mohammed, had a total vote of 180, representing 30.1%. 30 
thirty point eight percent. Sorry. Whereas on the other hand, Aisha Ibrahim had a total vote of four hundred and five, representing sixty nine point two percent. So Aisha Ibrahim is the vice president elect for Team KNUST. So the main president portfolio which was a very keenly contested oh sorry move to the um president portfolio i'd like to move on to the women's commissioner okay, which, was, okay. which was also very keenly contested as well between irene lois na anieli soa and caroline yaboa irene had a total vote of 78 representing 40.8 percent and caroline yaboa had a total vote of 113 representing 59.2 percent so caroline yaboa is the team knust women's commissioner elect yes yeah, so i left one portfolio out actually deputy organizer portfolio which was contested between someone asari austin and desmond keme the ladem with this one pulling 390 votes representing 66.7 percent and some more pulling 195 votes representing 33.3 percent so desmond came the ladem is the deputy organizer elect for team KNUST. so by a main president position which was contested as i said a killing con a king contest between Ebenezer Shiati Tete and Theophilus Aman for Beche, with Ebenezer pulling 280 votes, representing 47.9%, and Theophilus Aman for Beche pulling 305 votes, representing 52.1%. This is the result of the team KNUST 2021 Executive elections so tfls berche amanfo is the team president elect thank you very much election 360 live on air and online on focus fm 94.3 Election 360, live on air and online. On Focus FM 94.3. Yeah, All right, so just as you heard from the electoral commissioner, these are the people who contested for the various portfolios and the um, the votes that they were able to amount at the end of the election. So in case you did not get any of the declarations that he gave to us, we are going to let him run through those who were able to come out as winners for the various portfolios. For the various portfolios. 14 KNUST elections 2021 are Chris Santos Sangna, who won the deputy PRO position with 93.3%, Frida Ohinado, the main PRO, with 94.3%. 5% yes Desmond Keme the Ladem who won the deputy organizer portfolio with 66.7% Richmond Anabewa who won with 95.4% as the main organizer 
Emmanuel Kobina Ephraim also won the Deputy Financial Secretary portfolio with 92.8%. Awa Ahmed Sadat also won the Financial Secretary portfolio with 91.6%. Emmanuel Bawa, who won the General Secretary portfolio with 64.5%. And Selma Yoda also won the Deputy Women Commissioner with 94.2 percent caroline yaboa also won the women's commissioner main women's commissioner with 59.16 percent aisha ibrahim also put 69.2 percent and won the vice president portfolio and the president elect for 10k and usd theophilus amalfo beche also pulled 52.14 percent all right thank you very much mr thank ac you. for thank giving you. us the results of the elections thank you very much so this is where we draw the curtains on the election declaration from the Tain K University campus. And for your information, if you want to know what the Tain stands for, it stands for Tertiary Education Institution Network. That is um, for NDC on K University campus. Thank you very much for your attention and have a wonderful evening.